Uh, now let's dive deep into Tableau AI. When it comes to AI in Tableau, uh, it just helps you remove the repetitive tasks that you do uh, on top of it. It gives you actionable insights. It gives you notifications of the data that you might not be looking into, but, with, but, but that is something that might be very helpful for you. And also it can help you generate the right kind of data on simple prompts, right? That's exactly what it does. Uh, so if you'll write down, I want to understand which salesperson is making the most of sales in North American region and is less than two years of experience. So you'll not have to create all of the things or you'll have to create the, those uh, data sets and stuff like that. It'll help you do that and it'll give you the insight into it. So that's the power of AI that you can utilize with uh, Ains, uh, um, with Tableau AI. And also one, one most important thing when it comes to AI and Salesforce is, is the trust layer. Uh, why trust layer? Because it's it just masks the data that it takes and uh, so see, Salesforce is running onto a multi-tenant environment. And when it is running on a multi-tenant environment, everybody is sharing the resources that is pro uh, that it is providing out there. When everybody is sharing the resources, uh, how and, and and AI just utilizes the previous information which is fed to it uh, to provide insights to other customers as well. So the same AI is serving, let's say, uh, A business and B business. What are the chances of this AI not providing A's insights to B or something something related to A's data to B? Uh, there are huge chances, right? Because this AI stores the information that is provided to, uh, to it as a prompt as well. But when it comes to Einstein AI or uh, the AI and Salesforce thing, there is a trust layer which is added in which what happens is that the sensitive data which sent, get, gets sent to the AI gets masked first and then uh, the prompts get generated onto the masked data and then the unmasking happens again and then the prompts, uh, the, the the response of the prompt is provided to the user who has sent that prompt or who registered that prompt. But, uh, and and so, so this helps maintain the data uh, for each of the org that is using uh, any of the Salesforce products. And that's the beauty about it. Am I correct? Yes, you are. And one thing I would like to highlight, so for Einstein Trust Layer, you can go back to our previous webinar way yes. back in September. We yes. discussed a lot about it. So you can look back and have a look at it. 